Hello friends, here in this video, I am going to show you how to root your Samsung Galaxy S2 phone running Android 4.1.2 that is Jellybean firmware. In one of our previous videos, we have already showed you how to flash your Android phone with Jellybean firmware that is the official leaked version. And now in this video, we are going to show you how to root the same firmware so that you can install all those root apps or you can do more with your device. So now proceeding ahead, uh, before we do anything further, first of all we need to download the kernel, custom kernel package for applying a root to our H2 phone. So I have already downloaded the package and I have already uh, saved that particular package, that particular file on my SD card. And now I am going to just boot into the recovery mode to flash that particular package so that my phone gets rooted. So as you know, to boot into recovery mode first of all, I need to turn off the device. Make sure your device is charged and make sure you have backup all the contents of your device because always whenever you flash any device it may the phone may be bricked or may become unusable so it's always risky so be sure to take certain precautions before flashing any device now since my phone is already turned off now let me just boot into the recovery mode by pressing the volume up button here and and this home button and the power button by pressing all the three buttons together simultaneously I can boot into the recovery mode as you can see this is a stock recovery mode let me just zoom Now I have to choose the option using volume up and down keys. Apply update from external storage because I have saved the, that particular package, that particular file on my external SD card. So I need to select this particular option and to select any option you need to do is hit the power button on your right side. Now here I have the downloaded file here on my SD card. That is field CWM6 XXLSG 3.73 sign.gif. And now I need to flash this particular file on my H2 phone to get my phone rooted. Now I have pressed the power button and now the placing process has started. And it's done. You can just see it. It's done. Now all I need to do is reboot the system to see if my phone is actually rooted or not. It's loading. Android is upgrading a starting app. So as you can see everything has started without any kind of error or glitch or any problem. Now we need to test whether our flashing or the routing process has been successful or not. Here we have the new app Super Su installed.
let's launch the play store root checker Let's install this app so that we could check whether our phone is rooted or not. Install this app. verify root access is asking for root permission let me grant it congratulations the device is root access you can see it right here so this confirms that our phone is successfully rooted now let me just uninstall it root shaker okay Let's go to setting. Go to about. Here you can see that's the version 4.1.2. It's Jelly Bean and Red 4.1.2 version, and this phone is now rooted. So this was a quick guide and a and a easy and easy way to successfully root your phone without any kind of problem. Our recovery console in s2 phone is replaced by field touch 3 and this particular kernel is based on cwm base version 6 as you can see this fully supports touch based touch based actions Here. Here we have a new recovery mode.